In Unit 3 of AP Calc, when we use implicit differentiation to differentiate an equation like this one, we have to remember to differentiate each piece of the equation. If we start differentiating 3x squared e to the y, we recognize that we have to use product rule to get 6x, and then we'll leave the other function, e to the y, alone. But then we'll add to that what we get when we leave 3x squared alone and differentiate e to the y. Well, the derivative of e to the y is just e to the y, but then because we took the derivative of something that includes y, we have to multiply this by y prime. If we then wanted to take the derivative of this second term here, we would use quotient rule. So we would say that the derivative of the top is 2, but we took the derivative of something that included y, so we have to multiply by y prime. We multiply that by the numerator, natural log of x, and then we subtract from that the numerator, 2y, and multiply by the derivative of the denominator, 1 over x. Then we would divide that by the denominator squared, so we get ln of x quantity squared, and differentiating the constant on the right-hand side of the equation just gives 0.